Good to see you back here if you've watched any of my tutorial videos before. Welcome if you're new, my name's Kent. Thanks for joining me in this video on how to remove a sliding door or a security screen. Let's get straight into it. Security doors, you can't, you can't just pull them off. What we're gonna to need to do is adjust these adjustable screws that are here and here, same at the bottom. Some brands are different and they actually have the adjusting screws sort of at the top on each side and at the bottom on each side. So hopefully you can see past me. We want to adjust the screws. We'll start at the top on this one, but turn it clockwise until you've got a, a little bit of play at the top there. Do the same on both sides. And do the same at the bottom. Turning them clockwise brings the wheel assembly up towards the door. So now with all our wheels adjusted, two at the top and two at the bottom, we should be able to lift the door and pull it out at the bottom. Sometimes that's all you need to do. Because that's not coming out at the bottom, we're gonna to need to lift our wheel assemblies. I'll show you how to do that now. Now the door's roller wheels slide along this track at the bottom. Get your second screwdriver, your flat screwdriver. Even though we can lift the door, we're still going to need to lever up just gently this wheel assembly here. We can lift it up because it's on a spring, bring the door out a little bit and we can lower it down again. Do the same on the other side. Now that we've got those wheels off the track at the bottom, all we need to do is slide it towards us and it'll drop out of that top track. Door removed. There's one thing I'd do before I reinstall the door. Reinstalling the door is easy. It's just going through those same steps in a reverse order. But what I would do, this is the little track that the sliding door is actually guided by. Now I'd be inclined to clean up these channels. You can either just brush it out or vacuum it. The other thing I'd suggest too is get some lubrication around these little wheel assemblies. Do the same at the top and the bottom before reinstalling your door. Actually, while you're at it, fire some into the, uh, the lock, the barrel, and around the latch as well. When it comes time to adjust, tighten up these wheel assemblies so that the door doesn't wobble or rattle, but not so tight that it's stiff or hard to slide the door open and shut. Hopefully you found this easy. Hopefully it helps you with your project. If you found the video helpful, give it a thumbs up. If you haven't yet, subscribe and comment down below. Let me know how you got on with your project. I'll see you on the next one.